guys, it's Christina. I'm really excited to share with you Glisten by Statements. This was sent to me by the wig company to share and review with y'all. And so far, I've loved the other styles I've seen. So I'm really excited to try this one on straight out of the box with you. This is in the color R11S+. Plus. From what I see, it's a really nice light brown kind of color with some highlights throughout it. The style looks really fun with these bouncy waves and this really fun fringe in the front that I'm excited to play with. This is a basic cap, so it doesn't have any lace front or any mono top, but what I've learned is it really doesn't matter. It's actually very easy to play with and like switch up how you like, and they're very comfortable. So it has a velvet front here for comfort. So when it sits here, it won't be itchy or anything like that. It has the ear tabs, has an open wefted cap that provides some stretch. So it's definitely comfortable. And then we have our Velcro adjusters here. So what I'm going to do is this is straight out of the box. I'm going to put her on and then I'll show you what I do to make a wig my own. So I just put this front part of the wig right here on my forehead. I'll pull the wig back and I adjust it on my head once it's all done. So flip her back. So it always looks funny when you first put it on. So I'm gonna use these two fingers. These are the two most important fingers when adjusting and I'm gonna find those ear tabs. So I'm gonna take my fingers, get those ear tabs and then I'm gonna adjust it to where it fits on my head. I have the ear tabs fit typically right in front of my ear, not resting on it. It's almost like a sideburn. That's where it would rest and then come down. I use the four finger rule, so it needs to be pulled back a little bit. And that fits about right. So this is straight out of the box. It's a really cute style, but obviously I need to shape it up a little bit. It's been kind of sitting, you know, in a box until it got to me. But first look, super cute. Just turn around. This is the right side. This is the front. This is the left side. The front again. And I'll turn around and show the back. So that's straight out of the box. So I need to do something about the front. All the hair is falling forward. This is where I like to use my fingers. Now I can use heat. This is heat friendly synthetic. So you absolutely can, you know, spritz it with water, use heat, use a hot comb or a round brush, like a hot air brush to bring the hair back but I typically just use my fingers and I use my nails to really like get in there. So I'm gonna remove the part that came with it. I'm just gonna like bring all the hair to the front and then I'm gonna take my nail and just kinda make a part for myself like there. And then I'm going to use my nails again to really just dig in there and move the hair back like train the fibers wake them up i'm gonna shake them up get them off the cap they've been flattened out don't be afraid to mess up the wig it can come back i used to be so scared to like really get in there and think that i couldn't i had to be super gentle but it's okay they need a little bit of work sometimes so I'm really waking up the fibers, as you can see. I'm getting in there and getting them off the cap, getting them not flat so that they, I can move them. And then I'm just taking the hair and kind of directing it to where I want it to go. So as you can see here, it doesn't have a lace front, but the bang pieces cover it so that you really don't, you can't even notice. So that's just out of the box and me using my fingers and this is where we're at. I think this is so cute. 
The color is really pretty. It has almost these golden highlights throughout the light brown. And the waves are really, really fun too. I love the curls in it. It's like I'm ready to go apple picking or something. Super fun. Very lightweight, not a lot of hair. It's not the lowest density piece, but it's not overwhelming. It's super lightweight. It feels like it's not really even there. So obviously with this kind of wig, I'm not going to pull it back. You know, that, that I don't typically like to wear my hair back anyways, but I can definitely move the hair away and tuck. Or there's always a way to, you know, grab some hairs and I'm always going to leave like a bang in the front. But I like using a claw clip with my wigs. It holds the hair really well so I could pull my hair back as well. But this is a fun one and I really love the color. I've been trying to branch out. I'm a blonde girl, but I wanted to try some brunette wigs and some red wigs and I'm really loving the change. A little fall transition, but still have those peaks of blonde throughout. I mean, for the price point of this wig, I would say 100%. Yes, absolutely. I do love features that have a lace front. Um, I don't know, just for me, I like knowing that if I put my hair back, you know, I can see, you know, hand tied pieces, but this is changing my mind. These, this looks just as real. This is no filter. This is just me with the light on and it looks really nice. You can switch up the part too. I don't really wear a center part, but I'm curious. It has like the, the hair to be able to have a nice, curtain bang. Yeah, that's cute too. And a lot of wigs aren't, are always a left mono part. They're not a right mono part. So for women that like the right mono part, sometimes it's better to get a basic cap wig because then you have that option to move it to the other side and be comfortable and it still looks just as cute. Yeah. Thank you again, The Wig Company, for sending me this. This is absolutely adorable, and I'm really excited to, like, go out and enjoy this and show it off because it really is such a cute piece, and seeing myself as a brunette is such a new thing, but I'm really loving it. If you are interested, I am going to go ahead and po post the link in there so you can view it. You can use the code CHRISTINA30 and save 30% off your purchase. Thank you so much for joining me, and I am excited to continue to share new wigs with you guys. Have a wonderful day. Bye.